set of brakes I installed, stainless steel axle, aluminum plate. Pull right here, this is what actually pulls the rig. Water bottles and brake handle. So we're gonna go scout out another route through here. Cause this, this isn't gonna do. 113, I don't know if you see that. It's a little warm out here. Got caught in a sinkhole. It's just mud. Up here you can tell it's a lot drier. As soon as we get into this black over here, we should be good to go. I'm gonna travel up to a wash that I know is there. So these next six and a half miles could take many hours. Let's just hope that we can get through them. Everything was going fine until I hit a tar pit. I just sunk in. This is what I got. Show for it. Just gook tar all the way up. It's like uh, mud and oil. So I'll just take each bag, each barrel of water, and then finally the cart over. We have found hard surface. Right here. You feel this? Oh, hard ground. Mwah. Only 108, 108 and a half. So it seems to be cooling off. <sighs> well, let's get to work. Pretty simple. All right, let's get it packed back up and hit the trail. To really make it through these areas, you need a heart. Into the main wash and try to get up over on that plateau there. Oh, we're down inside of a wash here. There's all these big old rocks to get over. Oh, this is where the road ends. We hit a point where we cannot go on. We're surrounded by washes, completely surrounded. The only uh, option after that would be to travel in the main wash but it's not possible back to the drawing board back to the drawing board we'll crack it one day I gotta figure this out